Hi everybody, this is Mirav, and today I'm going to teach you how to add a pop-up to your Joomla ad agency. The first thing I want you to uh, make sure is that you have a zone that supports pop-up. So let's take a look at, we have two zones here, one of them is called floating transitions and pop-ups, we're going to click on that. And as you can see on add details, it does support pop-ups, transition and floating. That means this is very good, this is what we need, and we can close this and move on. Let's start by going to Add New Ads and then Pop-Up. Now there's three types of pop-ups. There's web page, images, or HTML. We're going to start, we're going to go over all of them. We're going to start with the web page. Basically what a web page pop-up is, is just a, a pop-up that contains a web page inside it. So we're going to choose an advertiser and we're going to enter a title, we're going to call it, uh, for example, ijoomla.com we're going to want it to be approved so that it will show on the front end you don't have to enter anything on keywords unless you want this uh, pop-up to show only on pages with specific keywords and in that case you'll have to go back to the zone and activate keywords there and here you just enter the URL that you want to show inside the pop-up and you can choose how frequently you want to show this pop-up every time, once a day, once a week. I recommend to leave it as once a week because you don't want to annoy your visitors too much. And for now I'm going to choose every time just, just so I can show you how it looks like on the front end. On properties you can choose whether you want it to be a pop-up or a pop-under. Pop-up means it shows on top and pop-under means it shows under the browser window. Now because we chose a, to show a website, you might want to show a toolbar, a status bar, a menu bar, and all the bars that come by default on the browser. And you also want it to be resizable. So it's not going to look like your regular pop-up, it's just, just going to look like a browser window. And the size we're going to choose, you have to make it a little bigger. So let's choose 800 by 600. On location, if you want to show the pop-up only in specific countries or cities, you have to click on this link and upload all the database of the geo-targeting and if you already have it, you're going to see here option to choose uh, countries and cities. Campaign, you're going to choose the campaign that uh, you want to, to show the pop-up on and we're going to choose the floating transition and pop-ups and we're going to click apply to see how it looks like on the front end. So here it is on the front end. As you can see, it just basically popped up a window with ijoomla.com in it and this is your pop-up that is based on an address, a URL. So let's close it and try a different pop-up. As you can see, once you chose a web page, you cannot change this pop-up anymore. So what we're going to do is we're going to save it. We're going to unpublish it for now. Let's just choose the uh, pending for now. And let's create a new pop-up. Again we're going to go to the left and click on pop-up and we're going to choose this time an image. An image pop-up is basically just a pop-up that has an image in it. It's not uh, that uh, complicated. And title we're going to choose a Joomla surveys. I have an image ready for that. We're going to upload the image right here. Here it is. We're going to click Upload. Again, I'm going to choose just for demonstration every time to show this pop-up. And on Properties, I'm going to choose No for everything because this is like a regular pop-up. You don't need to show any browser uh, toolbars and menus and stuff like that. And I'm going to leave the size that it is 300 by 300 because that's also the size of my image, as you can see here. But you can choose any size that you want and I'm going to choose the campaign, the floating transition pop-ups campaign and I'm going to click apply. Oh, we forgot the target URL. I'm going to choose a Joomla service homepage and click apply and see how it looks like on the front end. And here it is, here's our pop-up on the front end. And this is the image pop-up. Now let's move on to the next type of pop-up. Again, you can't change it here, so you're going to have to create a new one. 
let's just change the status to pending okay so if you want to create a new one we just go again to the left and click on pop-up and this time I'm gonna choose HTML and I'm gonna call it HTML pop-up SEO give it a good descriptive name choose the advertiser and when you select HTML it's just gonna show you an HTML editor which is what it is now and you can enter anything you want for example if I want to upload an image I'm just gonna click on browse I'm gonna upload this image here start upload and then I'm going to select it choose the alignment and just enter anything you want here let's do it again great extensions extension for SEO and I'm going to put any link that I want here or anything that you want you can basically create an HTML and then just copy and paste it here into the HTML editor or you can just start typing whatever you want here and that will work just fine you can add any links, you can add any images that you want, we're doing something very simple here but just remember that you can do anything you want choose SEO and click insert and you can also make the text bigger just like you use any uh, HTML editor alright I'm gonna choose again every time just for demonstration and now let's take a look what else we have here we have the size we, w we want it to look like a pop-up so we're gonna leave it a no for everything and we're gonna choose 300 by 300 and the campaign we're gonna choose the floating transition pop-up campaign and click apply and let's take a look at the and this is the pop-up with HTML that we created and this is how it looks like of course you can make it look a lot nicer than this and it's up to you So this is it about how to add pop-ups to your Joomla ad agency. Thanks for watching.